Sometimes that's always the uh, hardest part about getting to a race. Um, yesterday still presented his challenges. Uh, the plane and out of Des Moines had to be de-iced for like 90 minutes, which caused me to uh, miss my next flight. I am looking at the bright side here. The next flight that I originally got transferred to was going to get in around 9 p.m. yesterday, um, but it, I kept flicking through the flights to alternatives. Um, and at some point I was able to grab one that got here around 3 o'clock so much better I'll take that any day uh, plus then there's not even any issues with getting in the Airbnb uh, which I'm sharing with a bunch of triathletes this weekend uh, so that's, it's been pretty fun uh, I was able to still put my bike together get a little ride around town and get kind of the layout of the land uh, and then uh, went for a run with Evan um, and uh, yeah, after that I grabbed some good food over at the local tap house um, just down the street. So, good little venue. Looks like everything's going to be really close to each other. Um, so, getting to the course, getting to food and all that will be really easy. Getting my fix as well. You know, I went and got some coffee already this morning. So, yeah. Enjoying it. Plus, it's beautiful out. My gosh. It was snowing when I left and now I'm in, I guess, it's still in the 50s, but for us islands, that's pretty damn nice. So, yeah, sounds fun. Phoenix, you're bursting a fire burn. A thirst and desire, you transform it up in a flash. You spread your wings and rise from the ashes. Phoenix, you burst in a fire burn. A thirst and desire, you transform. All right, well that was the end of the pre-race uh, and you guys kind of saw the race already at the beginning. So uh, to kind of recap how it went, um, I think it was a good performance mentally. Uh, maybe not so much physically on the day. Um, I was able to come out of the water in a relatively good position. I didn't quite realize that there was a pack ahead of me um, and so I I didn't make the uh, effort to jump up, but 
maybe should have. Uh, I did feel in more control than I have in uh, a swim in the ocean or swim in open water uh, in a long time. So that was good. Uh, looks like Russell's going to be joining us. Um, okay. <laughs> uh, anyway, so yeah, came out of the water. Uh, it, was, it was top 30 um, and then kind of worked my way um, through transition. Uh, relatively good, got the wetsuit off in reasonable time. Um, and then, um, <laughs> one sec. <laughs> Sorry, Russell. All right, back to it. Um, start out on the bike wasn't exactly uh, up to par on my bike handling since I haven't really rode it that much um, due to the fact that in Iowa it is still cold. So, um, yeah, I, I was riding um, fairly well after I got through about 10 miles. was in a group, uh, ended up getting a penalty, um, kind of going up a hill. Uh, there was a moto kind of in the way. I should have recognized that. I did not recognize that. Tried to make a pass. Couldn't make the pass within 25 seconds. Um, so got a penalty uh, for taking about 32 seconds to pass. So live and learn. Um, I sprinted into the penalty tent. Uh, I thought it was a 30 second penalty. Uh, and it was actually five minutes, so kind of burn a match there. And then coming out of penalty tent, made another rookie mistake and uh, sprinted to try and make up ground that I should have just came out of the gate steady uh, and I would have done a lot better. But I was pretty dead by the time I hit about 35 miles, so uh, that's a long way to go. Um, I was still able to get off the bike uh, and kind of settle into a controlled pace on the run after trying to kind of jumpstart the system. Um, you know, I, I finished, uh, you know, and I hate to say, you know, I had all these excuses and everything, so I was just going to say that I just didn't have it on the day. Um, had made some tactical errors, uh, but we got some big performances ahead of us. So uh, ended up finishing um, 35th uh, with 62nd overall. So uh, did get beat by a good chunk of people, but, you know, I'll keep my head up and uh, kind of get ready for the next big one. So. Yeah, thanks again for watching, and uh, on to the next race. Training first, of course, though. Thanks again. Like, comment, subscribe.